up on, subscribe when you're around here, and I'll see you guys next time. Appreciate you as always. Thanks for watching. Catch you later. See ya. Perfect. Alrighty. Let's get it, baby. Ooh! So we just finished up with the stream for Raider Storm, and now it's time for the Titans in the Hills. Come on, baby! Brap, you baby! You brap, big boy, brap! Oh, uh, well, at least it's not raining for the time being, but... Shit, man. Hey guys, how you going? So today on Peak House Sport, we're here at Seabus Super Stadium for the Gold Coast Titans versus the Butamata Squeals. Yes, the Butamata Squeals. The Squeals, mate. Yeah, we're going to make them squeal or not? Oh, I don't know. I wonder if they even know who you are. I don't even think they know. They do. Well, he's been like, how many years? How many years has he been on here? Two, three, four, five. He's just been, you know. Let's just go ten. He's been becoming a woman. Becoming a woman, there's one over here. Mr. Uh, Mrs. Dan Meyer. Oh. Soon to be Mrs. Dan Meyer, sorry. What do you mean? What do you Soon mean? to be oh, Mrs. No, no, Dan no. Meyer. But obviously, guys, we are here for. No, no, we don't want to hear you, what you have to say. We don't, we, we don't want no, to hear you defend yourself. Keep, let's continue. We're going to continue. That's what we're doing. So, <laughs> we haven't done one of these intros in a long time. Usually, I sit out there, but. I want to get inside and, and uh, you know get amongst it. Uh, is that fire, by the way? Have got the fire things right there? Yeah, we're going to get burned alive. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, well, you know, better than the, uh, the game against the Warriors. Weren't you in the mascot that day? I was, yeah. Yeah, he was in the bloody mascot, but now... Yeah. Now he's been replaced. He's been replaced for someone uh, who's not a Man United fan. So, anyway, guys, obviously the Gold Coast Titans... Oh, yeah. And his name's Dan, so yeah. better Dan, who's not a Man United fan. No, ah, no, no, now no, we're no. talking. Come on, let's just start. We, no, we, we are continuing. So today, guys, obviously the Titans versus the Parramatta Eels. Now, look, it's going to be an interesting game. The last time we did play them was back in round one, and uh, we controversially <coughs> lost. Robbed. That's another way to put it, and I like that way of thinking. But we lost by four points in that one. Since then, Titans have been a bit, how you going, here and there, here and there. But the Eels did lose to the Sharkies, and uh, that was not exactly... But they did thrash the Dragons last week. They so. did thrash the Dragons last week, but the Dragons are also not that great. No. So <laughs> they're not that fantastic, you know. So look, I actually genuinely believe that we have got a good chance of winning tonight. I just finished the Raiders Storm stream, and... Uh, I'm just excited. It Not really, mate. It was a bit of a... We had some good people on the stream, though. You guys are awesome, but he just doesn't get it. You know, he just doesn't He just doesn't get it. But what do you think about the game tonight, Dana? It's going to be a tough one. Yeah. It's, we need to control the eels, or we'll get thrust. I think that every intro we've ever done, you've said it's going to be a tough one. Well, I feel like always. that's the word, the exact words. I, I want you guys to go back and look at it. Yeah, yeah, that's my go-to. I think it's his go-to, yeah. It's going to be a tough game. No, it should be a good game, but tough. See, there we go again. Well, what do you think about the Titans this year? Obviously, we had that game in Canberra that we don't talk about, uh, that we went up 22-0 and, came, and then obviously they came week, back. And then last week, we... Uh, game of the year. Still won, though. Uh, yeah, hey, it was a game of the year last week. Taking two points. <laughs> so what do you think about the Titans this year? We, we need to do better. Mm? Especially in our first and second half. Like, our... <laughs> Especially in the entire game, the first well, and second yeah. half. <laughs> well, it's been a mixture of both. First half, we've been good. Second half, yeah. shit. So we just need to do a complete 80 minute game of football. Where well, actually, kind of. So well, some games we've been really good in the first half and shit in the yeah, second half, and some yeah. games in the second half we've been really good yeah. and shit Switch in the first half. Yeah, it's so. always what it's been. So we just got to cut out the mistakes, the errors, penalties. I'm going 28-20, you're going... 22-18. You know, you know what, I'm going to go 28-16. That's a point up, mate. That's the biggest score we've had because every game's been decided by two points. Every game. Is it though? No, Eels game was four. Every other game was two. Raiders 24 22, yeah, 8 6 right. Titans over the Tigers. That's true. And the other game was the Warriors 20 to 18. Alright, oh, well, 2018 then. 2018, I'm changing to 2018 then. Well, we had that three weeks ago, so well, we why don't you get a bit of originality behind your score? Oh, why don't you get a bit of an originality behind your scoreline? 22 18 then, I'll stick with that. Let's get Lock it in, Eddie. Lock it in, Eddie. Well, we're locked in and we're ready to go. Go, boys!
saying you're not the more one. Yeah. No, Brimo said no. Oh man, that's unlucky, man. We had it. Oh, 
you scored now, let's get a chance. Fire up, Titan! Fire up! Fire up, Titan! Fire up! We will, if you're gonna talk shit right here, bro, we will get you for chance. Unfortunately, it just didn't go our way in the first half, and then we were able to find that and then push it in the second. Yeah, we just didn't, didn't win those crucial moments in the first half. And AJ just about scores on one end, then, then they go down. Yeah. Uh, they the field, and basically, they're just trying to 
they were still in all those key moments and we weren't doing that in the first half, but in the second half we, we did and changed the game a little bit, but it was a bit too late. I'm here with the CEO, Steve. Mate, uh, what are you thinking about that one? Uh, I thought we gave too many points away early, but the back end, the back end of the game showed we're starting to build inside that team, which is a real desire to win. Yeah, a bit like last week where we weren't flash, but we granted a win. Um, and on the back of that, you can build on anything. I think we've we got some things we need to tune. Yeah, that's all that. Intense good. I was just saying to Kev just then, like obviously we didn't have any possession in the first half. The second half we did have all the possession, and the second half is when we came back. So, do you think it was just more of the fact that we couldn't hold on to the ball tonight? Uh, we definitely had some errors in us, and we released pressure by giving away penalties. So. It's ears to fix. Well, obviously, we're looking good going to the future. What do you think of the Manly game coming up? Oh, I'm looking forward to Manly. Mm. Um, we go pretty well down there. Yeah. Um, it's another game. It's another It's another piece of experience for these young halves. Um, we've got a middle that's going forward. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to the weekend. You know, Tommy. Can't wait, mate. Good. I can't wait. <laughs> and with the coach, Justin Holbrook, mate, uh, unfortunately, we lost that one. We gave it a good go. We tried hard. We uh, fought for the 80 minutes. But, yeah, we just lost some key moments, especially in that first half, and couldn't get them back. Look, obviously we're an incredibly young side, but you know we are still showing signs very early that something can happen this year as well. Like, do you think that we are making the right direction quicker than we expected? Oh, I'm not too sure at the moment because I've you know did a lot to win that game tonight. So yeah. Um, but anyway, yeah, I think we, you know, we've got plenty of good enough players to get there. We just got to hurry up and start winning those type of games. Well, hopefully we can slap Manly next week, hey? Yeah, hopefully we can nice. slap them. Anyway, guys, that's going to do us here for today's video. I hope you did enjoy. Obviously, hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new around here because, obviously, I'm pumping out content pretty much every single day. Uh, you guys would have already seen this one coming on Monday, so we would have done the UFC stream yesterday, plus the two NRL games, but I'm here, obviously, with Entertain House, Muppet, Gee whiz. You know, we, uh, you know, you're lucky. You are lucky. What are you thinking? Very lucky. Uh, I think Isaiah Papalihi was probably my man of the match. If uh, Brimdog hey, Millionaire. Brim Millionaire. I think Brimdog Millionaire had a brilliant game for the Titans. I thought we got out of jail towards the end there and had that good lead. And then when, when Junior Paulo went off, just a game changer. Uh, but the Titans look good. And I think you mentioned earlier um, to a player that... Possession. P possession is the one thing. But the other thing, that that was your biggest loss of the season. Oh, yeah. And the fact that we're five rounds in and the Titans are playing that well, they, they definitely look like a, a top eight team. i jump off here, guys. Uh, by the way, I hope I got good footage of that streaker because she got... How memorable was that? She got slammed, dude, and it was incredible. But like I said, guys, I appreciate you. Uh, what's coming up this week? I'm going to Manly next week. I will be in Manly for the Manly versus Titans game. So stick around. Well, I don't know why I'm saying stick around because you're already subscribed. I appreciate it anyway. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Catch you later. Oh, don't forget. Go check out Entertain House. He does... YouTube as well. Yeah. <laughs> he has YouTube as well. He's basically the Paramount version of me. There you go. Alrighty guys, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Catch you later. See ya.